Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Chase and Zelly, and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question I've been getting a lot recently on my other video, and that is how do you activate Zelly in the Chase app? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is going to be a really quick video. There's really not too many steps involved, so be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you want to register and activate your Zelly in the Chase app? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe your clients are asking if they can pay you through Zelly. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Chase app. It's this blue and white one right here. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to open up my Chase app now. Okay guys, I went ahead and opened up my Chase app. This is the home screen. Here on the home screen, if you want to activate Zelly in the Chase app, first you need to click on this little button down here on the bottom left called pay and transfer. It has a little dollar sign next to it. Once you click there, you will see a few different options. However, in order to activate Zelly in the Chase app, you want to click on this button here called send money with Zelly. It's up here on the top center. Okay, so next you need to read over and agree to the Zelly service agreement and privacy notice. You can see the full document by clicking on this blue button right here. Once you're done reading it and you do agree, click on this little check mark and then click on this blue next button here at the bottom. Okay, once you click there, you're going to see a little bit of information about your account. First, you want to make sure that you have chosen the right checking account that you want to use with Zelly in Chase. Also, they let you know your name is going to appear here to the recipients for your Zelly payments that are sent through Chase. And then here you get to choose which email or or phone number you would like to have attached to your Zelly account. For me, I'm going to use my cell phone number right here. You can use your email. It's basically the same thing, except for you're going to receive the authorization code through email instead of text message. For me, text message is easier. Once you've verified all this information, click on this blue next button here at the bottom. Okay. Once you click there, Chase immediately sends a text message out. There is no button to send it. It just automatically goes out. So you're going to need to read your text message and then enter the code here. I'm going to go ahead and enter my text message verification code now. Okay. So here's the code. All right, once you've entered in the text message verification code from Zelly, click on this blue next button here at the bottom. Okay, just a quick second later, the page refreshes and you'll see this confirmation saying you're all set. Now it lets you know that you can send and receive money through Zelly on the Chase app. Also note that you will receive an email from Chase confirming that you have activated Zelly in the Chase app. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to activate Zelly in your Chase app, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.